All right, good morning. This is uh, Andy. He's gonna be changing the cups here at uh, Legend at Bristlecone. A couple of the reasons that we change cups here is to uh, reduce wear on the green. We have a lot of golfers that come through. We wanna maintain a good playing surface for them. So we move cups every day so that we can provide that for them. And he selected his location for the pin sheet for today. Now, he did not go all the way down. He didn't want to leave an imprint on the green of where the cup cutter was. Now, he's going to take this nice plug, is what we call it. It's the uh, sand profile with the turf on it, and place it in the old hole here. Now, as he goes back, he's going to grab another cup from his bucket. He's going to clean up the edges here a little bit. Make sure that the ball has no obstructions as it rolls into the hole. Now it's important as we do this to make sure that you don't make any mistakes. So it's arguably one of the most important jobs on the course. As he steps that down, he makes sure that that cup is set in place so that when he puts the flag stick in, it is not going to wiggle. It's not going to come loose. And it's going to be perfectly straight up and down. Attention to detail is something that we pride ourselves on here, and so that's what Andy's doing. He's taking his time here. Now, every day we, we also paint the cups. A um, couple of reasons why we do this is, one, for detail. It looks nice. Uh, everybody can enjoy what the pros enjoy every day. Uh, it also helps speed up pace of play by being able to locate and see the hole better when you're putting. Now if we look, it looks pretty straight up and down to me, Andy. It looks good. Yeah. Yeah, it went all right. So now we're going to come over here where he's replacing the old hole with the plug that he had just cut. So he's got to make sure that when you replace that plug that it sits flush on the green. We don't want any high plugs, otherwise the mower will cut that grass right off of there. And then you'll have a bald spot on the green. We don't want that. Uh, if he doesn't have enough sand, then the plug will be low. And there will be an impression on the green, and your ball will roll through that and bounce. So now he's knitting the grass, so everything looks flush, as almost if the cup had not been there the day before. Adds a little water, a little drink for the grass. Rolls it out nice and flat. What do you think, Andy? Can you still see it? A little, but a little it, bit. I don't think uh, it should affect play as it rolls over. After a day or two, you won't even be able to tell that was there. All right, thanks, Andy.